there viewers welcome to our free concept tv headline i am too big to have a godfather president Tunibu was begging me to be minister erufai the immediate past governor of kaduna state uh, malam nasiru erufai has said in a viral video that he is too big for someone to be his godfather erufai said he had told president bola metunumbu on several occasions that he didn't want to work with him the progressive congress apc chieftain said the incumbent president had been the one pressuring him to work with his administration but that he has repeatedly rejected the offer erufai said his is this sell this while gathering granting a brief interview to journalists recently i met with bola ahmed Tunumbu over 10 times and told him that i do not want any government job i do not want to work with him he's the one pressuring uh, pressuring me to work with him i have been the one rejecting the offer to work with him um i'm too big for someone to be my godfather erufai said in also language we recall that Erufai was one of the former governors to be listed on his ministerial nominee list forwarded to the Senate a week ago for screening. However, Erufai was not confirmed by the Senate over alleged security reasons. Earlier, a presidency source who spoke with um, source revealed that Erufai was no longer interested in becoming a minister due to his current doctorate um, program but would continue to contribute his quota to the development of Nigeria as a private citizen. The source said he also told the president that he needed time to focus on his doctorate program at a university in the um, Netherlands. The former governor is studying for a doctorate in public policy at the United Nations uh, University, Madrid. Another insider also told the pu publication that Erufar suggested a new ministerial nominee, um, Jafaro Ibrahim San, for Cardinal State, saying the president would find him helpful and resourceful. Also, during the meeting, President Tunubu also told the former governor he received petition critically to his ministerial nomination. The president, however, demanded 24 hours of grace to review the petition and the SSS report to the Senate to enable him to reach a decision. The immediate past governor of Kaduna State, uh, Malam Nasiru Erufai, has said in a viral video that he is too big for someone to be his godfather. Erufai said he had told President Bola Metunumbu on several occasions that he didn't want to work with him. The progressive congress APC chieftain said the incumbent president had been the one pressuring him to work with his administration but that he has repeatedly rejected the offer. Erufai said he's is this sell this while gathering granting a brief interview to journalists recently i met with bola ahmed Tunumbu over 10 times and told him that i do not want any government job i do not want to work with him he's the one pressuring uh, pressuring me to work with him i have been the one rejecting the offer to work with him um i am too big for someone to be my godfather erufai said in also language we recall that Erufai was one of the former governors to be listed on his ministerial nominee list forwarded to the Senate a week ago for screening. However, Erufai was not confirmed by the Senate over alleged security reasons. Earlier, a presidency source who spoke with um, source revealed that Erufai was no longer interested in becoming a minister due to his current doctorate um, program but would continue to contribute his quota to the development of Nigeria as a private citizen. The source said he also told the president that he needed time to focus on his doctorate program at a university in the um, Netherlands. The former governor is studying for a doctorate in public policy at the United Nations uh, University, Madrid. Another insider also told the pu publication that Erufai suggested a new ministerial nominee, um, Jafaro Ibrahim San, for Cardinal State, saying the president would find him helpful and resourceful. All right, viewers you have listened to today's news oh you have heard the headline okay erafa is saying that tenebu is on that is begging him he's begging say please join my you know you know, say beg, you know that word begging means you now kneel down fold your hands and say please join my administration without you it's going to die please. you understand what i'm trying to say okay so let me not exaggerate it so much you know but when they say begging you know what begging means now <laughs> all right Let's read comment. What he says, so many people are getting double pay is salary as ex governor, senator, or ex governor slash minister. Too much greed class in this country, and yet the one and only wage of the masses are what the people at the helm says is improve in improvising the nation. What he says, 
liar, a bloody liar. You forgot that you came to South West so that Morik will help you out. With all Morik said, you are a failure and that's how you will be till you return to dust. Amen. <laughs> because I heard, I, I read when Morik, where they said Tunubu need to Tunubu need to make him the 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 uh, minister. Tunubu need to make, make him a minister that he that he's the one that was able to convince the North people to vote for him. So now he comes out to say that Tunubu Tunubu is the one begging him that in fact he's no longer interested. So what we should do? Do they want us to believe? Killer boy, killer. Do they want us to believe? Somebody here says Erufai. A okay, okay, is enough. Somebody here says. Erufai was forced by Tunubu to be part of his government for good governance, but unfortunately, okay, we did best did not finish his statement. But here it says, it's truly he's too big. He shouldn't have attended the nomination interview. It's just a bragging when the dream failed. God sees you all. Uh, so even if, if even if please, people, what, 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 what was that? So somebody cannot just attend uh, this thing. Uh uh-uh, uh, please, please. Nobody in this commercial to to have this uh, error file. What's that? Uh, I don't like it though. Is it? It, it, it just maybe just went there to see how things are doing. Maybe just went there to just look at uh, what is going on, how things are being done. Do you understand what what um what people are saying? What people are what people are, are how the government the, uh, about people that they want to nominate? Not that him he is interested. But on, he has said it that he's not interested. People should leave him now. A big kilo shell, eh? Yeah? He's not interested. So there's no there's no there's no there's no way that uh he, he's not interested. Kote fe, only way is not he does not want kofe a bi. I feel there. Ah, what a bit what is that? He says he does not want. So people should calm down. The, the man said he does not want. So let let us let us chill. Let us chill. Let us chill. Ah, uh-uh, what's that? Please, oh, he said he doesn't want. Everybody say leave you, leave me alone. Back to the comments. What he says is truly he's too okay. This is good radiance to bad rubbish. Thank God, a professional and judas and uh, I don't know. Okay. What he says. The truth has been established. Somebody says, and why did he attend this entire interview? The secret between all of you shall come out one day. <laughs> Can't he just have, maybe you just want to attend to see what is going on? Not that he's interested. Oh, no, oh he just said that he's not interested. Uh uh-uh. uh. Please. The man said he's not interested. People should leave him. Nobody should beg him. Don't beg him. Let him he says no, let him be let him be a beg. Kilo Shelley. Somebody says, I hope he always remember this word dust for dust. Here. Somebody here says too big because of what you have staked in your vote that will last your fourth generation. But God has the final answer. My dear, my dear, God will help us in this country. Is God that is going to help us in this country. Those that are those that thief money, those that pack everything. Well, it is well. We hope and pray that God will see us through in this country. All right, viewers, you have come to today's news. Please do well to do by the comment section. Let's know what your views are. Thank you for listening.